The James Webb Space Telescope is here to take you on an extraordinary adventure through the stars. As one of the most remarkable and expensive scientific achievements of our time, it is also the best and most advanced space observatory built by NASA. With the JWST, we have been able to capture stunning pictures of nebula, star clusters, and other celestial phenomena in the Milky Way. So join us now and let's explore the universe together through these breathtaking pictures. Number 1. Tapestry of Blazing Star Birth Check out this cosmic version of an undersea world teeming with stars. This is a picture taken by a telescope called James Webb. It shows two big clouds of gas and dust called NGC 2014 and NGC 2020. These clouds are located in a galaxy called the Large Megalanic Cloud, which is near our own galaxy, the Milky Way. NGC 2014 looks like a big red coral in a sea of stars. The center of NGC 2014 has big and bright stars. Each one of them is 10 to 20 times bigger than our Sun. NGC 2020 is a blue cloud located on the lower left corner of the image. It was created by a very bright and big star, 200,000 times brighter than our Sun. This star has been shooting out gas, creating the blue cloud we see in the image. Number 2. Clusters Dusty Ribbons Explore the dynamic star cluster, NGC 346, located 200,000 light-years away within a nebula. The Webb Telescope reveals a wealth of building blocks for stars and planets in the form of dust and hydrogen clouds. The image shows plumes and arcs of gas containing two types of hydrogen, pink, which is hot and energized, and typically as hot as around 10,000 degrees Celsius, approximately 18,000 degrees Fahrenheit, and orange, which is cold and dense, typically as cold as around negative 200 degrees Celsius or less. That's approximately negative 300 degrees Fahrenheit. The cold gas is an ideal environment for star formation, and as stars form, they shape their surroundings as seen in the ridges and pillars of glowing gas. The image also shows the effects of stellar erosion throughout the region. Number 3. Quasar Tsunamis Discover a distant galaxy with an active quasar at its center, in this image captured by the James Webb Telescope. Quasars are known for emitting large amounts of energy generated by a supermassive black hole fueled by infalling matter. Using the unique capabilities of the Webb Telescope, scientists have made a groundbreaking discovery of the intense radiation pressure coming from the black hole, which is pushing material away from the galaxy's center at a significant fraction of the speed of light. These quasar winds are propelling hundreds of solar masses of material each year, drastically shaping the surrounding gas and dust and affecting the entire galaxy. Number 4. Protostar L1527 Check out this image of the Protostar L1527. It's surrounded by a cloud of stuff that is helping it grow. Some of the material that the star has thrown out has made empty spaces with bright orange and blue edges. There are also some bubble shapes in the center caused by the star, shooting out material in different directions. With the help of a special telescope called Webb, scientists can see thin lines made of gas that have been heated up. Notice how some of the edges of the empty spaces are straight while others are curved. The bottom right of the picture looks blue because there is less dust blocking the view. Number 5. A Wreath of Star, NGC. 7469. This is a picture of a beautiful spiral galaxy called NGC 7469. It is located very far away, 220 million light years away, in the constellation Pegasus. This galaxy is very big with a diameter of 90,000 light years and a bright center. It also has a special ring of stars that are forming very fast located just 1,500 light years away. Scientists can now study this galaxy in more detail and learn more about the relationship between the fast star formation and the dust and gas surrounding it. Number 6. Revisiting a Celestial Fireworks This image captures the awe-inspiring beauty of a supernova remnant, the remnants of a massive star that underwent a violent explosion. The remnant appears as a brilliant flame with long tendrils of gas that radiate a bright orange and blue glow. 
The remnant is situated in the large Megalanic Cloud Galaxy, which is located close to our Milky Way Galaxy. It is approximately 160,000 light years away from Earth in the constellation Dorado. The remnant is surrounded by a scattering of small blue and red stars, adding to the striking visual contrast. The background of the image is a vast expanse of blackness, speckled with tiny red stars that add depth to the image. This image is a mesmerizing reminder of the power and beauty of the universe. Number 7. Cosmic Smokescreen Cosmic Smokescreen, NGC 6530, is a big group of stars located 4,350 light-years away from Earth, in the constellation Sagittarius. It looks like a big cloud of smoke with lots of stars inside. The bigger cloud around it is called the Lagoon Nebula. It's made of gas and dust. The whole image is full of different colored clouds. In the center, the clouds are bright and have a lot of texture like smoke. On the edges, the clouds are lighter and less dense. There are also some small bright blue stars in the image. Number 8. Globular Cluster NGC 6355 this breathtaking image captures a celestial wonder known as a globular cluster, located in the constellation Ophiuchus. NGC 6355, as it is called, is located just 50,000 light-years away, and is situated in the inner region of the Milky Way galaxy. The cluster is home to thousands of stars, with a high concentration of stars in the center, forming a circular shape. The center of the image also reveals an abundance of blue stars, while the edges showcase redder stars and a plethora of faint background stars. This image truly showcases the beauty and complexity of our galaxy. Number 9. Supernova Remnant This image from the James Webb Space Telescope shows a supernova remnant in a galaxy called a small megalanic cloud. This means that it's a cloud made up of gas and dust that's left over after a star explodes. The supernova happened a long time ago, and the galaxy is located around 200,000 light years away from us. The different colors in the image show us how fast different parts of the gas are moving. The blue parts are moving toward us, and the red parts are moving away. These gases are moving extremely fast, at an average of 3.2 million kilometers per hour. To give you an idea of how fast that is, imagine you could travel to the moon and back in just 15 minutes. Number 10. Jupiter Auroras, near-cam close-up. This stunning image of a composite of several photos taken by the Webb Telescope, it captures the auroras at the northern and southern poles of Jupiter, shining in red, yellow, and green. The great red spot, a massive storm on Jupiter, and other clouds appear white due to the amount of sunlight they reflect. The image also highlights hazes swirling around the poles and light reflected from deeper main clouds in blue. Number 11. A Bell 370 Parallel Field In this image you can see a lot of distant galaxies and a surprise. Even though they are relatively close to Earth, only about 260 million kilometers away, they appear small compared to other galaxies in the image. This image is a parallel field for a galaxy cluster called a Bell 370, which is a part of a project called Frontier Field Survey. The image contains different types of galaxies, such as big yellowish ones, beautiful blue spiral ones, and small blue fragmentary ones. The reddest objects in the image are probably the furthest galaxies, and their light has been stretched into red color by the expanding universe. This image is a reminder that space is full of surprises, and you never know what you might find. Don't forget to leave a comment below, and let us know which of the top 11 images was your favorite, and what other space-related topics you would like us to cover in the future. Also, don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content like this.